Commitment! You're always welcome here. Come back later. The Night Runners built these windmills. Ready to get me to the center? I'll tell you everything when you get here. Hurry up. Break it up. Civilization. Did you see that? Elvira stripped naked and stepped under the bus. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. Just like that, she uncovered her lungs. Yeah. <laughs> 
People will always complain. We're alive, and that's what counts. This is madness, Sophie. The peacekeepers have more weapons. Men. They will crush us like worms. Ator may have more men, but we have the home field advantage. Home field advantage? You're crazy. I forbid it. While I lead the bazaar, no one will attack the peacekeepers. You no longer lead the bazaar. What? You're no leader, Carl. Never were. We lost people because of you. Crystals. You almost got yourself killed. My mother wanted a free bazaar, not slaves serving the peacekeepers. I want to restore peace here. You can help me with this, or leave. Roger, Humphrey, arrest them. What are you doing? They want to betray the bazaar. Roger! You have no power anymore, Carl. You want to be like your mother? You'll have blood on your hands, Sophie. A lot of blood. Carl is right. We don't stand a chance in open battle. Sophie! What the- Therefore, we're gonna weaken them first. What do you mean? We'll cut off their main source of electricity. Without UV lamps, Ador can't defend his base. They will be driven from the metro tunnels and cut off from the armory. How does all this get me to the central loop? Once Ador is weakened, he will retreat for reinforcements. Then you can make it to the central loop, Aiden. But first, we have to blow up the windmill. And fast, before Ador gets wind of what we're planning. Barney, gather our people. Be ready. Roger and Humphrey, go to the armory, provide weapons to anyone capable of fighting. And you, Aiden, go to Alberto and Vincenzo. They'll walk you through the plan. Okay. Community and freedom, Aiden. Together, we will win. This new armor of yours, it's flimsy. More fit for a beetle than people. Yeah, way too thin. Fierstein! Peter shows a great protection! This is top craftsmanship, made from the finest quality materials. Built from... Ah! Ah! Uh-oh, I can almost see the steam pouring from his ears. Look out, <laughs> he's gonna blow. <laughs> titanium. We reinforce the armor with titanium we pulled from the scrapyard. That's why they're lighter, and better protection. You guys shouldn't be such dicks. Well, why didn't he just say so? We'll see. Thanks, Vincenzo. You didn't have to. It was nothing, Dad. Ah. As for you, those two oafs took the last titanium vests. No, I'm not here for armor. Sophie sent me. You're supposed to bring me in on some plan? The plan? My plan? Call agreed? Call agreed! You hear that, Vincenzo? Not Carl. Sophie. You gonna share or do I have to guess? Windmill. We take down the windmill. Bingo! The big windmill that provides power to the PK headquarters. 
But first, we need the charges that Jack and Joe left at the water tower. Hmm? Would you bring them to us, Pilgrim? After we blow it up, all the UV lamps in the PK headquarters will go out. That'll allow the infected to attack them. Hmm? Old Villador will be free again. And you, you have a clear route to, uh, uh, you know, uh, the past chemical fallout uh, and to, uh, uh, what's it called? The central loop. The central loop, right. How do you know the PK will withdraw and not retaliate? Because Dad designed this windmill. He knows it like the back of his hand. And it's the PK base's only power source. Without it, the PKs won't last another night in Old Virador. But we must act fast before the peacekeepers catch wind of our plans. So, you win? Uh, fine, I'll do it. Okay, go to the water tower. We're going to use the charges that Jack and Joe tried to blow it up with. Let me know once you get there. Got to blow up this, uh, you know, uh, windmill. The peacekeepers took it from us. Little. But hey, wait. We've met before. I'm Aiden. What's your name again? Maya. What are you doing here, Maya? Looking for bandits. Gonna beat the crap out of them. 
But I'm hiding from the infected right now. Ah. So, what did these bandits do to you? They stole lots of stuff. But the most important thing was... Oh, they're here! There she is. You're done following us around, you little shit. Told ya. You're dead, kid. Don't worry. How about I beat him up? Hide. This won't take long. You're dead! Dog this! <laughs> <laughs> And they're the ones who stole your stuff? No, there were more of them before. The rest probably haven't. What's this most important thing they took? My music box. Why is it so important to you? It belonged to my mother. That's all I have left of her. That does sound important. To find it and I'll let you keep it if you do you did save my life the bandits went into that building overlooking a construction site on William the ninth road you gotta get it from them if you won't then I will whoa 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 little I mean my lady don't worry I'll handle them if you can't find them just stop and listen the music box plays a melody like this during the day. Go at night. They always go back to that building at night. Why don't I take you home? Where do you live? I'll go to the bazaar. By myself. I'm not a baby. If you don't want to keep the music box, you could sell it there. It's worth a lot. Case. They've been searching us for weapons. Found our Molotovs and went ape shit, slaughtering everyone in sight. Looks like someone set us up. Who? And where are the bombs for Alberto? We managed to send some out. The couriers last reported near Star Square. Then silence. Alberto, the charges are gone. I'm going to the Star Square. That was their last check in. Exactly. Aiden. Yeah. Be careful. Someone sold us out. Find the, the, the charges. Without them, the plan cannot proceed. Doing what I can. I'll be in touch.
That was some fight. The PKs ambushed your transport? They searched everyone and everything. Eventually, they found the bomb. Someone tipped them off. And they took everything? Dunno. Suddenly, something scared them off. And what? Where are the charges? Hey! Um... They were in the yard. Come on. Maybe they didn't steal all of them. Lucky few of the infected showed up. Everyone scattered, probably leaving the bombs behind. Don't know why they didn't steal them. They were right under their noses. Morons. <laughs>
the charges.
took the rest. Damn, damn it, triple damn. Because of that traitor, our plan is in danger. We must act quickly. No, nitrates. We need fertilizer. Then we can make more explosives. The old night runners, they've got everything. And certainly all we'll need to make more bombs. I know a guy lives on a rooftop. Friend, not foe. It depends. Killian, you know him. Hakon's friend, Killian? Yes, Killian. I'll explain how to... Uh, how to... Uh, uh, I know the way. Thanks. Aiden, without those nitrates, we're as screwed as a... a, a viral in the sun. Everything all right? No. Everything is not all right. Please. It's my boys. They've gone missing. I haven't seen them for hours. Mo is 13. Scotty's 16. Please. Yeah, boys their age do tend to wander off. Uh-uh. Not my boys. They always tell me where they're going and when they'll be back. This time was no different, but... My birthday's coming up. It'd be just like them to get into trouble planning a surprise. I'd die. You understand? If something happened to them, I'd... All right, I can try to find them. As a pilgrim, I did plenty of tracking. What? A pilgrim? You're lucky this is about my children. I know what sort of people become pilgrims. Otherwise, I'd want nothing to do with you. I just want to help. Where should I start to look? Right here. Sometimes they play with this filthy little boy by the church walls. All right, I'll check it out. You stay here and wait. Maybe they're planning a surprise for my birthday.
me after all this trouble. <clears throat> Killian! Killian! It's Aiden! You there? Killian! Hack on. Back then, everyone must have thought BFFs forever. Bingo. Alberto, I have your fertilizer. It's Vincenzo. Vincenzo? I, I can barely hear you. The PKs, they raided my place. I can't talk. The traitor, he sold us all out. Hayden, Dad went ahead to the windmill. Meet him there. I'll meet you when I can. Just make sure that fertilizer gets to my dad. Okay, I'll do my best. Just come quick. They're still after me. Yeah. I'm pinned down, Hayden. Another patrol. You have to do it without me. Join my dad. I'll be on the radio the whole time. Me and your dad? You think that's a good idea? We have no choice, Aiden. Hurry. Please. if you noticed, but Dad's kind of awkward and unappreciated. This is a chance to show Carl, Sophie, everyone at the bazaar that they were wrong. What Dad's made of, what he can do. He'll be the hero of the bazaar after this one. He always wanted to do something big. That's exactly what I'm afraid of. I'll stay with you on the radio. Hello? Vincenzo? Hello? Chancellor, I, I can't hear you. No, Barky, you have to... What? What do I have to do?
fertilizer. Are you sure you got this? Of course I'm sure. And if I don't know something, I can ask Vincenzo. The windmill's causing too much interference. The radio doesn't work. Ah. Then I'll figure it out myself. It's as easy as pie. And you're certain? He explained everything to me. Relax. We'll do... Me and you will do... <laughs> no reason we won't do just... Uh, Fine. Like I said, easy as pie. The bombs are ready. You're up. Take the charges and secure them to the spots Vincenzo marked for us. Planting bombs. <sighs> what could go wrong? Easy as pie, right? Yes, precisely. Like I said, easy as pie. The bombs are ready.
Closes are in place. Time for the fireworks. Would you like the honors? Sure. This should be fun. Mm -hmm. Triggering. Must be interference from the windmill. You. That doesn't look like that did much. The windmill's still standing. I mean, the rotor's still spinning. Uh, Vincenzo's calculations. They must be off. is fixed in a flash. Gotta see this through. It's my fault, not Vincenzo's. What are you doing? An armed bomb? Before the PKs get here. Giving you an armed, um, uh, uh, armed, uh, uh. We can't rely on radio detonation. Not with all the interference. What now? This one is guaranteed to blow up the whole windmill. All right, how much time do I have? Let me count. Hmm? It'll blow any second. Run! But where am I supposed to put it? Where? You have to go back. And? And plant it on... Uh, 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 place it on... Uh, put it on... Uh, right in the middle of the windmill? I can finish my own sentences! Thank you very much! Leave it by the base of the windmill? No! <laughs> that will accomplish nothing! On the rota! You have to climb up to the rota! To the very top? You serious? The bomb's ticking, Ada. You really think we have time for jokes?
faster. Go on. <sighs> Master.
Alberto? Sons of bitches. What have you done to him? standing almost like the fireworks in 90 um, 90 uh, even ah oh, man i'm old 
And you'll just keep getting older. Quit the bullshit, Aiden. I'm not that adult. <sighs> Thanks for helping me. <laughs> I know what they think of me. Of course I know. <laughs> Tell everyone we pulled this off thanks to Vincenzo. Okay. <laughs> That's thanks to you, Alberto. No. Thanks to Vincenzo, okay? They laugh at him. Laugh because of me. <laughs> but now that we've done this, they won't laugh anymore. See, his, his old man's, eh? Not a cook or a, or a failure anymore. <laughs> Force the peacekeepers to withdraw. Say it was him. Promise me. All right. Okay. Oh, and tell him. Tell him that... That's okay. I'll tell him. That I'm proud. Never told him that. Son, I'm proud of you. I'll tell him for you. I promise. show you put on. Now it's time to blow this popsicle stand. I can't. One thing I still have to take care of. You don't get it. There's no time to waste. We can make our way to the center now. Everyone's too busy to notice. I promised Alberto I'd tell his son something for him. Do you want to finish your business or play shepherd spreading the good word? Well, it's bad news, Hakan. Alberto is dead. I see. But the metro is empty. There might never be another chance like this. Are you sure? I have to go find Vincenzo, Hakon. I promised. A night fucking errand. Hurry! Remember Sarah and Yana. Find me at their place when you're done. If you're still alive.